I'm Nita Callahan, and I live in Lee County, off of 308, 311. And here. Right here. I'm Nika Callahan. Okay. Okay. And uh, I oppose the uh, wells that they want to put in and, and uh, during our drought conditions and uh, the issues with that. And I hear on the news, and I'm sure in this area, people listen to Austin. And every night they keep talking, talking about the uh, lake being so low every night. Uh, both of the lakes they keep talking about how they do not send water down to the Rio Grande because of the drought. And so I figured this is real abuse to, to what water we have underground right now with our well. We just had to do some, a bunch of servicing to the well that we have, which was expensive. And I'd like to see them put a moratorium on this uh, water. First of all, we never hear how big the horsepower or the pumps are, mine is only half a, a half a horsepower, whatever you say. It's, it's small. And we don't run it 24 hours a day. And it, that bothers me because we have no proof, and even with Alcoa, how much they're using daily, let alone what this event might do to us. And uh, I figure if people want to lease their water, then we need to go to Plan B and let them put a copra dam, clear down the bedrock and just suck their water out and quit sealing all of everybody from the community that didn't sign no lease agreement. And, uh, also in Houston, Texas, I, I also think there's real weakness on the security in our area. Uh, most of the people that work out there on the pipes that I've witnessed in the last couple of years uh, have no I idea on who they are. The men will know who they are. Since I worked with Camp Mabry in 91 for a few years and Houston, Texas got their water tainted by plutonium with the muslins since our water goes clear down to San Antonio, which is the backup to the Pentagon, our military. And so this could kill off half of Texas if it was abused. And I have witnessed people doing something, one person in a car on Sunday, and I always call 911. If they're unidentified and their truck aren't marked, I call, because I, I mean, that's the least I can do. And then I get out if I don't feel threatened and I talk to them. Um, the other little thing. Yeah, 15 seconds. Okay, the other little thing is, I think we need to rise up. If people want water, there is uh, flooding up in the north. We need to bring our pipes down. If we can do it with oil, I think we could, we could offer water coming to Texas, we'll purify it and let them bring it down. They know it's going to waste in all this blood. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you, sir.